Hi, I'm Chef Laura Hahn, chef and blogger for Guilt-Free Foodie Cutie, here today in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, at Greens Grove Community Incubator Kitchen. I'm going to show you how to make peanut butter banana cream icing. Let's get started. This is a great recipe for any fun muffin or cupcake you can come up with. I'm going to kind of show you a condensed version, so if you only have a few that you want to decorate, otherwise you can double or triple this recipe. So in this bowl, I'm starting with one half of a banana mashed. Here I have heavy whipping cream, already done and whipped, so it's easier to show you. It's about a half of a cup. I have powdered sugar. I'm going to use about two to three tablespoons to bind everything together. And of course, one tablespoon of peanut butter. Let's get started. So with our banana, we're going to combine our peanut butter. Oh, peanut butter. I love it. it smells so good. This is a great recipe to have a, a kid help you with and decorate some cupcakes for school, whatever it may be. Okay, so we have that peanut butter with the banana. I'm just gonna whisk it all together. It just takes a few seconds to get that peanut butter in there. Most icings are made with butter, so the peanut butter works really well as that fat to bind everything together. Okay, so now once you have your peanut butter and banana together, you want to add your heavy whipping cream. Just heavy cream whipped together with a little bit of powdered sugar. You can buy the store kind too if you don't want to make it all from scratch. Okay, just like that. Just get your banana, your peanut butter, your heavy whipping cream. Love the smell of peanut butter. Okay, now, like I said, you're gonna use two to three tablespoons of powdered sugar. The reason I'm not giving you an exact amount is it really depends on how it binds together. So right there, we have about two. Let's see how that works. If your banana's really ripe and soft, you're gonna probably need some more sugar, whereas if it's a uh, underripe banana and it's firm, you'll need a little less. Add a little more sugar. That should be good. Okay. And this is what it looks like mixed. Now, I have a final product. I love showing icing in a shot glass. It's a shot of icing, that's awesome. Again, I'm Chef Laura Hahn, chef and blogger for Guilt-Free Food Acuity here at Greens Grove Community Incubator Kitchen. And that's how you make peanut butter banana cream icing. Enjoy.